Begin from the nation's capital, where the House of Representatives has invited the Minister of Foreign Affairs and the Chairman Nigerian Diaspora Commission over the alleged victimization and maltreatment of Nigerians in Addis Ababa. It also seeks the intervention of security agencies in resolving the long standing border disputes between Nigeria and Republic of Benin in Ibukoji community. A National Assembly correspondent Jokia Adisa reports. Minority leader Kingsley Chinda and 10 other members co sponsored the motion on the need to investigate alleged victimization and maltreatment of Nigerians in Addis Ababa. If early intervention and diplomatic measures are not taken by the Nigerian government, to check the incessant attacks on Nigerians in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, and air, tra air travelers will be at risk. The House resolved to have an interface with the Foreign Affairs Minister on the immediate and remote causes, as well as measures to protect Nigerians and air travelers to Addis Ababa. In another motion, the House sought an end to the long-standing border disputes in Igbokofi, a border town between Nigeria and the Republic of Benin. The few men of the Nigerian police posts in the community are completely unarmed and have to run for their lives when they sense danger. To control the prices of goods in the interest of the masses, the House urged the federal government to re-establish a price control board across the country. But agricultural petroleum products, essentially petroleum metal spirit, automotive gas oil and clothing to ensure that manufacturers and farmers do not impose, impose price arbitrarily. On the occasion of this year's International Day of the Girl Child, the House canvassed sensitization of adolescent girls on dangers of drug and alcohol abuse. We also urge the ministries, departments and agencies that are saddled with the responsibility of training and empowerment to ensure compulsory vocational skills acquisition training for girls to keep them engaged. The House also called on the central government to declare a state of emergency on the status of primary health care centers. Mandates the Committee on Health Services to facilitate their activities to ascertain the release state of primary health care centers across the country. The House canvassed job placements into the civil service of the Independent National Electoral Commission for youth corps members who were victims of election violence in the course of the discharge of their responsibilities. Jokia TVC News, Abuja.